Yo, so what is up guys? Welcome back again to my channel and if you're new here, then let me introduce myself first. I'm Gabriel Manuel, I make videos about personal growth, finance, investing, crypto, and other fun and interesting stuff. So if that interests you, then feel free to like my videos, click that subscribe button, and hit that notification head. Hit that notification bell for you to stay updated updated all right guys by the way this video is going to be one of those videos na ilalagay ko sa playlist ko for those videos na hindi ko masyadong ini-edit kasi like it's more of an update lang about my portfolio about my crypto holdings about my altcoins and my investments and personal growth ko na journey by the way right now hinahawakan ko ang libro ito it's atomic habits by james clear and so far, I'm on page 150 na. I decided to read this book because of the good reviews na nabasa ko about this one. And so far, so good guys. Ang ganda ng librong ito. Maybe in the near future, I'm going to upload videos that are related to this book. But um, right now, I guess, this is set aside muna natin ito. So, yeah. Alright, let's begin in the question, why is crypto crashing right now? So if you guys hold um, some Bitcoin, some Bitcoin Cash, some Ethereum, Polkadot, um, Dogecoin, Shiba Inu, and other altcoins that are like very hype sa market right now, then napapansin nyo na pababa siya. And on my back, nakikita nyo <laughs> yung holding ko ng BZRX. Oh my gosh. Tingnan nyo guys. <laughs> diba? Um, to be honest lang no, my portfolio is down for like 10 to 15 percent na this past 24 hours lang. So just imagine if you have a hundred thousand pesos in your portfolio after 24 hours, nagiging 85 or 90 thousand na lang ito. So that's a 10,000 to 15,000 difference na agad. And yep, ang sakit sa part natin no. <laughs> so, so ano na, papaba na lahat and Tingnan natin guys yung, yung holdings ko guys. I have more or less 20 altcoins na hinahawakan ko na tinitrade ko as of this moment. And usually guys sa kanila guys, nakapula talaga sila guys. <laughs> OMG. I have RGT around 12% na yung baba niya for the last 24 hours lang. So ayun, back tayo sa question natin. So, dapat ba tayong mabahala? Dapat ba tayong mangamba? Um, is it now the right time to panic sell? Well, panic sell na, di ba? Obviously, hindi yung sagot ko. It's not the right time, don't panic sell. It's just a correction lang sa market, guys. Alright, maybe some of you are going to question me like, Wait, Gab, akala ko ba walang makakapredict ng market? Like, even Warren Buffett, wala siyang Buffett. Even Warren, like, even Warren Buffett, wala siyang masisay about dyan. Hindi niya mapre-predict yun 100%. Even, even like, the most advanced machine, hindi yan mapre-predict. So, bakit right now sinasabi mo with all the conviction, with all the confidence na it's just a correction? Well, guys, um, you know, disclaimer lang, I'm not a financial guru nor a personal growth advisor or something like that. I'm not a professional trader or a professional broker by any means, but um, I've been in the crypto world. I've been in the market for quite a while now. It's, it's been more than a year since I traded, since I I jumped, I dive into this this field, you know what I'm saying? So, nakita ko na to previously. I mean, months ago, weeks ago, years ago, kung ito trace natin back, Makikita na natin yung pattern dito. So if you guys want to, to like me teaching y'all like ano yung trading strategy ko, ano yung basics ng trading, parang ganun, how to read the candlesticks and stuff like that, then feel free to comment in the comment section down below. Para naman ang gawa natin yun ang video for our future uploads, you know? So yeah, it's just a market correction lang. But you know, it's just for me lang ha. Personal take ko lang yun. But Kahit sino namang YouTuber dyan, kahit sino namang um, trader dyan, investor dyan, I'm sure, 100%, sasabihin lang din nila na, for me, in my own opinion, sa tingin ko lang. Kasi nga, it, it depends kasi eh. There are hundreds and thousands of, of like strategies, how, how to trade, how to invest in the crypto world, in, in the metaverse, in the stock market, and um, yung strategy ko might differ sa kanila or yung sa kanila might differ sa akin but yeah I'm quite sure I'm in my high hopes na at the end of the year 
magi-green lahat to. And sana nga. So my suggestion is that if you guys are holding Bitcoin right now, um, Ethereum right now, BCH right now, Polkadot, Shiba Inu, and Dogecoin. Yes, yung anim na yan. Isama na rin natin yung... Wait, guys. XRP. Yeah. Kung meron kayong pitong altcoins na yan, guys, then I highly recommend to just hold your altcoins. Don't panic sell. Um, think about this way. The market is on... It's on sale right now. So, bili kayo ng marami kung meron kayong pera. And ako personally, wala akong budget right now. So, please don't skip my ads, y'all. And I'm saying, just chill, guys. Don't, don't like, don't think too much about it. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't overthink it, you know? I mean, I know na it's our own hard-earned money. But um, if ever matalo mo tayo sa market na to, then let's take that thing as like, you know, bayad natin. Na... I mean, nabayad natin sa market for us to know better. I mean, alam naman natin na it's better to lose our hard-earned money into something that we know than like, lost our hard-earned money sa mga investment na yan na nag-garantee sa atin ng 5% monthly, 10% monthly interest tapos bigla ang nawala kasi nabilanggo na. Of course, dito ay nagpaparinig dito guys, pero like, kung alam nyo, alam nyo. Right? I guess that will be it for now. Thank you so much guys for watching and as always, sana sa bye-bye niyo pa ako sa future journey ng buhay ko. Bye. Peace. Wait, magta-trade na tayo guys pa-bira. Oh yes, yes.